What's going on guys, it's Jho bringing you a brand new video and today I'm going to show you guys my Trials of Osiris loot from last week on all three of my characters. So last week's Trials map was Rusted Lands and we saw this map once before in year 2 of Trials earlier on in the rotation for year 2. And it looks like Bungie's not bringing out any more new maps for Trials that we haven't seen yet because it's been another week where we got another repeating map. So hopefully they throw in a curveball on us and give us a rotating map week. I really think that was a really good week when they did that in year one. Or maybe we'll see something new, who knows. Bungie always throws surprises at us, but let's get into my loot for this week. So starting off on my first character, on my hunter, from the lighthouse chest, we ended up getting ourselves an inward lamp and four motes of light. And my inward lamp came in at 314 attack with the hidden hand perk on it. So a pretty average drop on that first one. And then for the Trials Bounties on my Hunter, we got some Passage Coins, Motes of Light, and Legendary Marks. From the Silver tier, we ended up getting Unlucky with no Exotic. And from the Gold tier, we got an Armor Piece, so that's pretty cool. I always want Armor Pieces from the Gold tier. And this one was 304, the Chest Piece for the Hunter with Arc Armor and Sniper Ammo with intellect and discipline as well so pretty solid drop on that armor piece for the gold tier moving on to my next character on my titan from the lighthouse chest we ended up getting another inward lamp and five motes of light this time and this one came in at 318 attack and the third eye perk so pretty good at least we got a higher attack value on the second one and then for my Titan Trials Bounties, we ended up getting more Passage Coins, Motes of Light, and Legendary Marks. From my Silver Tier, we always get Unlucky with no Exotic. And from the Gold Tier, we got a normal Reflection Sum at 303 with the Head Seeker perk on it. So pretty solid a Pulse Rifle if you're looking for a decent one for Crucible. Finally, for my last character of the week on my Warlock from the Lighthouse Chest, we ended up getting ourselves a Water Star Hand Cannon and an Exotic finally. We got a Plan C as well. So my Hand Cannon came in at 310, which was pretty poor, but I did get an Exotic Plan C from that Lighthouse Chest. So finally got an Exotic. It's been a while since I got an Exotic from the Lighthouse Chest. And then for my last set of bounties on my Warlock for the week, we got more Passage Coins, Motes of Light. Blue Engrams, Strange Coins, from the Silver tier, we got no Exotic once again. And for the Gold tier, we got the Unseeing Eye Machine Gun at 300 attack. So, pretty solid machine gun. I always say that, but I already have one. So, that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!